you take on You like you leave out Ah ah <laughs> This is the school, Abby. Yes, sir. Life College. Yes. Which life get college? College. Eh? Which life? Uh, uh, hello? How are you? Uh, come, come, come together, come together. Uh, where is your uh, headmaster? Principal. Oh, Tom. Principal, headmaster. Where is the difference? I didn't know all teacher. Uh, hey, your headmaster. The man will get this place, the owner of this place, your headmaster. Uh, ah. Sir, uh, uh, you Hello, sir. Hello. Uh, Hello. How may I be of help to you, sir? No. You are not one to help me. I'm the one is the to help you. I, I bring business. Business? Uh, yeah, I'm a customer. I bring business for you. This, uh, is, uh, this is Simon, uh, and uh, Peter, Peter. my son. Eh? Peter is Shut up! Simon and Peter. The two of them know they inside this Bible. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. For register. Um, of, sir, uh, please, sir, I came to enroll in this college. Oh, we want to enroll in our school. Uh, well, uh, Mr. Jamil, I can show you what I'm going to do. I can show you what I'm going to do. Uh, Mr. Jamil, uh, if your ward wants to enroll in our school, there's a process to it. Please, do follow me. Uh, ward. Um, <laughs> enroll here. Give him a form to fill and let me have the details in my office later. Okay, sir. Uh, hello? So? Headmaster. Kes kese. Kes what? Sharing formula. I'm a customer. I bring a customer for you. Where is uh, my 50%? Sharing. 50% commission. I mean, you know, go collect school fees. Excuse me. But you have not even paid. Don't worry. Pay me in advance. When we pay school fees, you remove your own. What is. I, I, I don't do business like that. Eh? Yes? Hello? Ah? Again? Shabby, you want them two times. Don't want them again. Give them. Number five. Give them number five. Every one of them. Number five. Number five, fool. Ah! It's beautiful, live in love and peace. Ooh. Ooh. Life is beautiful, just live in love Life and peace. Life is a calling. Get prepared for it. Life is a calling. The head in should be the same. That's why I haven't typed the others yet, sir. Hello. Hello, young man. You may come in. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, sir. I think he's a new student, sir. Oh. You asked me to come today, sir. I did. Um, Peter. Yes, sir. Uh, his uniform, please. Okay, sir. Where is that your uncle who came to register you the other day? He traveled, sir. Why isn't he here this morning? He explained that day that I'll be out of town this week, sir. He did that? If he didn't tell me, then who did he tell? He explained to me, sir. He told me he would be out of town today. Moreover, he has signed the documents already. All right, then. <clears throat> Bring this file to my office. Okay, sir. Here we go. Thank you. Sports wear, games wear, Wednesdays, uniforms and everything. Yes,
Okay, okay, okay. Now let's get back to the story, all right? Now we understand that uh, uh, according to this particular story, Things Fall Apart by Chinua Achebe, we're made to understand that the main character is who? Okonkwo. All right, good. And we've been made to understand that Okonkwo is a visionary, is hardworking, and is resilient. And I'm hoping one day that when you all grow up, you'll be like uh, Okonkwo. Do you understand? Yes, All right. Good morning, ma. Good morning. You must be the new student. Yes, ma'am. Oh, you're welcome. Huh? Can you tell us your name? Peter Degunle. Mm, Peter Degunle. You know that uh, the fact that you're a new student doesn't mean you should come in late. You didn't know our resumption time. Okay. Uh, you may go in and have your seat. All right, class, let's continue. Just look at this one. Looks like he's haunted by something. Hey, hey I knew I had seen him somewhere before. <laughs> what? How? Where? Like, how could you have possibly met this kind of human being before? I mean, the guy rides a bicycle to school, like a palm wine tapper. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I didn't see him in real life now. Come on. Oh, you met him in your dream, Abby. So he's your dream boy. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> who came here said it looks like someone who is haunted and I remember that I had seen him somewhere before, in a horror movie. Look at his shoe. Oh my God! Like... Life is beautiful, life is beautiful. Yes. I didn't bring it, ma. You know you always need your books in my class. You should share with someone. I'll be fine, ma. You will be fine. How? I will listen as everyone reads. Okay. Decorum. Anyways, uh, who remembers what I taught you about the importance of background story in a novel? Anyone? Chide. Um, that to truly understand a character, okay. we need to know his or her background story. Amazing. A round of applause for Jide. Uh, Ken, uh, please read the first paragraph of your essay. Um, in order to 
be a hardworking person, one must have other representative values including honesty, truthfulness and respect. All these values are the things that make up a person to make sure that they are hardworking in their every aspect of life. All right, good. A round of applause for Ken. Life is beautiful, just live in love and love. I said, what is it? I'm... Um, I just need to know one thing. <laughs> one thing? Do I look like a Google app to you? <laughs> I want to know why you and your friends are always making fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, students. Does anybody want to answer him? I... Me, 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 auntie. Okay, my dear. Answer him. We laugh at you because you're a palm wine tapper pretending to be a student. <laughs> <laughs> I beg, Jerry, let's go. She is Yes, now. Like, with the clothes that he wore. <laughs> the trousers. Even his shoes. Oh my god. The way he was walking. <laughs> it was walking oh like Mr. Pepe. I was, <laughs> I, was just, I, was, I was thinking whether we're celebrating Christmas or something. I was like, oh, oh this is actually the same father. What's going on? Forget that man. What about the wedding party that he went to on Saturday? Yes, <laughs> that's true. Party. Oh my god. I met Funky Aki daily. Seriously. And even MJ. You are like, joking. <laughs> I'm not joking. <laughs> I was breathing the same air MJ was breathing. I was so happy. Oh my god. I was so I I oh god. I Seriously, this is becoming a habit. Why is this boy always so late? No discipline. What else? He doesn't know how to manage his time. <laughs> my dear, he's always late because probably he sleeps late at night and reads all night so that when he comes to class, he can answer all questions. So a teacher will know him as the most brilliant student in class. My dear, you get it. <laughs> What a delusional boy. <laughs> He's forgetting. Continue with the battle. Yes. Yeah, so, I saw her. I was, I was very happy. I was like, came up next. Good morning, class. Good morning. Have your seat. How are you all doing today? All right, good. Let's see how many of you have done the assignment I gave during the last class. Everyone did assignments, ma'am. The whole class? Yes, ma'am. Amazing. Uh, let me take a look. Thank you. You can have your seat. Peter Degonle. Yes, ma'am. Stand up. Who did this for you? No one, ma. I did it myself. Are you sure? Yes, ma'am. Okay, have your seat. Thank you. All right, class. Uh, let's open to page 45 of our text for today. Life is a college. Get prepared for it. Life is 
It's a college. Get prepared for it. Life, it's a college. Get prepared for it. Mr. Lero. Yes, sir. Exactly. What are you trying to say? That a special eye be kept on him, sir. The other day, he scored a hundred percent in the class test I give the students. I have a feeling something fishy is going on. I like. Maybe seeing the questions ahead of time. How is that even possible? Considering the fact that the questions are with you before anybody sees them. The more reason I am more confused, sir. Okay. I'll do something about it myself. Okay. You may go. Oh, all right. And do tell him to see me in my office. All right, I'll do that right away. Especially you. I remember we just got these instruments about two weeks ago and now look at the condition. Master Regule? Yes, ma'am. Where are you coming from and where are you going I'm coming from the classroom on my way to the staff room, ma'am. You're in the classroom while everyone else is on break, away from the classroom. Yes, ma'am. I was trying to use my break time to do some reading, ma'am. And you're going to the staff room to do what? I'm going to the staff room to see the next teacher that is coming, ma'am. Who sent you to the staff room? Ma'am? Is there anything you want me to know? No, ma'am. Okay. Life is beautiful. My to see. Me? Yes. Life is beautiful. Just live and Did you hear me say Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Uh, 4 p.m. I'll be in my office. Thank you very much. Peter Degole? Yes, sir. How are you finding your stay here? Fine, sir. But it could be better, sir. Really? Yes, sir. Peter, I want you to know that I've got my eyes on you. Me, sir? Yes. Always remember, before you do anything here in Life College, that nothing escapes me. I see everything. Never forget that. I know everything that is going on here. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Good. 
You may leave. You don't like associating yourself with other students. Why? I do. But... Oh, but, guy. It is obvious you don't want to have anything to do with us. Sometimes, life gives you reason to stay within your limits. Hmm. That's why you don't have to explain yourself to anybody, no matter what happens. And he speaks in riddles. How cool <laughs> is that? <laughs> life itself is a riddle, my friend. I saw so many questions on his face. Oh, so you're now a psychologist, right? You're no longer a musician. <laughs> Um, who knows? I can be a psychologist in the future. Oh, so with a psychologist, mm -hmm. engineer, mm -hmm. and producer at mm -hmm. the same time. In fact, who knows? I can be playing table tennis tomorrow. Come on, let me just pay you again, ah. Jerry. And I see your crying face. Ah, we are now. <laughs> Got a few words to tell you now. If you like, you take them. If you like, you leave them. Leave a series of natural changes Don't resist it, let reality be reality Let things flow naturally When life's too easy for you, beware You may not be ready to just the blow Say you yeah Say you yeah Oh, I feel he uses that location because probably the place is far away from school. So are you saying he rides his bicycle to school after his work? And that is why he's almost always late to the assembly. Yes, because after school hour, um, he's back there again seven fruits. Are you sure? Um, very, very sure. He's always there every day, ever since that Monday I saw him. And I, I even made my driver pass through that road and... You did? Yes, ma. I, I got down and I made him see me. At first, he was ashamed and embarrassed. Well, I just had to manage to get him to the car and we talked. I lost my parents in a car accident when I was eight. Nah, I lived with my uncle. Boy and his wife were so cruel to me that I had to run away to save my life. <laughs> and ever since then, I've been living from hand to mouth, sleeping under bridges at night. And any time, all that guys will try to make me do things that are bad, I always run away, you okay? Because I remember the teachings of my parents before their deaths. Well, I, I thought it was actually your uncle who enrolled you to school or something. That was not my uncle. It was just one random man that I paid to pose as my uncle. I'm sending myself to school. I want to become great. I want my parents to be smiling in their graves when they see me. Like my dad will always say. The only thing that can stop you from achieving greatness is you. So I'm going to become great, no matter what it takes. I'm so sorry. I, 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 didn't, I didn't know. I am my friends. We, we treated you so badly. Yes, Ma, you are right. I feel this happens in movies. I didn't know it happens in real life. A boy of his age is just too young to go through all of this. You are right, Ma. I feel if we can help him out, I don't know if you can help us or the class, we should just organize something just to make him happy. Honestly, I don't know right now. Maybe I should just speak with the person. The more you explore, the better for you. Hey, this is 
the summary of what I'm trying to say. Life is beautiful, live in love and peace. Ooh. Life is beautiful, just live in love. Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday. Is your speech ready? Definitely, sir. Take the floor. Thank you, sir. Good day, everyone. You see, Peter's story only reminds us that almost everyone, I mean, most people go through one thing or the other, but what they need is actually not pity. What they need is either listening ear or a shoulder to lean on. And as our principal will always say, that life is a community of what? Love and friendship. Life is a community of love and friendship. Clap for yourself. <laughs> now, thank you very much, Bukola for that wonderful speech. Thank you. <clears throat> uh, now, Peter Degule, and once again on behalf of all of us, a happy birthday to you. Congratulations. changes don't resist it let reality be reality let things flow naturally when life's too easy for you beware you may not be ready to just the blow say you yeah say you yeah all life's an experiment summary of what I'm trying to say. Life is beautiful, live in love and peace. Ooh. Ja, ja, oh, ja, ja. All you got to do is ja, ja. Na J J, no stressing, na by process. Life is a gift that's been given to you.